wari lazun pe ati gba ninu kan mewa ta ngba ta mere fun ati bi mefa bi meje gba eje ka de wo wa ye ma se ri ti oyin bi a de le ta se ka yi fi oro session le but one be the session e fun o on be the instruction e fun o on be the journalism e fun o on be the statistics e fun o on be the state police e fun o e wa ni pe iruro di right bi won o de le ja won ni ele da ti won o and the federal government will buy it because most of the region will not depend on it for federal allocation. For instance, the United States has a population of 333.3 million people. The US get, US get its independence in July 1, 1776, and it has indivisible union of 50 sovereign states in the U.S. Statism is the order of the day in the U.S. Also, South Africa is living frame of the most prosperous country in, Af in Africa now. And this is a country that suffers from various challenges We support them in the thing of their struggle for liberation. South Africa is a constitutional democracy with three tiers system of government an independent judiciary, the national, provincial, and local level of government, all have legislative and executive authority in their own sphere, and are defined in the Constitution as distinctive, interdependent, interrelated. The legislatures, parliament, the national legislature or parliament consists of two houses, the House of Assembly, National Council of Province, whose members are elected by the people of South Africa. The South Africa has nine provinces, with varies of insights, the smallest in thin and crowded context, a highly urbanized region, and the largest diverse are arrayed in empty northern Cape, which take up almost thirds of South Africa total areas. The development in South Africa is as a result of the system of their government. The transformation in Cape Town, Johannesburg, are likened to that of Europe. Once of the development toward the Cape Town, they were the Cape Town, no Ibony. They were the Europe, Europe, they were. They were the Amorigion, for the South Africa, they were the Africa, they were. And they were very well done to Africa. I was at Africa to law. The late Nancy Mandela became the president of South Africa, and today they enjoy the best through quality leadership. The budget of South Africa today is far higher than that of Nigeria. The economic prospects of South Africa are from tax, tourism, and solid media. Here in Nigeria, it is sad that our tourism sectors are collapsed totally. It's as a result of insecurity, lack of good infrastructure, infrastructure and bad image. Unfortunate, unfortunately, Nigeria has over 600 tourism sites and destinations that can attract tourist, tourism, tourism, sorry, all over the world. We want the total overhauling of our constitution so that we can go back Go back to regionalism, which formed the basis of our coming together as a nation in 1960. On this note, I would like to commend the sixth governor of the Southwest for the historic voting head on Monday in Lagos. I also commend the governor for appointing their, their Lagos state counterpart, Mr. Babajide Sowonu, as the chairman of Southwest Government Forum. Lagos State is no doubt the economy now of Nigeria. And the state will always offer the best to support other states in the region. Finally, late MK Abiola spoke during his campaign that if he became the president of Nigeria, he will organize a sovereign national conference. The late Ayala Abiola knew the imperative of restructuring and regionalism, and all these were ingrained in his manifesto. President Bruno Jonathan made similar efforts. When you organize the most successful national conference, Peter Blake, 
the report and gathering does to the the immediate past president, General Muhammad Buhari, even attend to the content and recommendation of the conference. And that is why we have we are here with her today. But it's never too late for President Bola to look into the recommendation and work on those content that are helping for finish the dream of our public funding projects. I know that it will make an empty Abiola will be happy in his grave that he didn't die in vain. The time to rescue men here through restructuring is now. Thank you for listening. God bless you. We have our friend, Conrad Joseph Ivers here. Thank you for coming. Please give clapping hands, stop clapping for the general Misubo. He's not yet fighting himself. On the one hand, he's here to raise the two right here. Keep clapping for the 15th Valley of Loka Kapo of Yoruba Diana. Who is the most, or one of the most uh, distinguished personality and the national conference in 2014.